Okay, so good morning everyone. Thank you very much for joining me this morning. Um, it's always nice for me, especially when it gets to skincare. And now this morning, I'm actually a little bit on my nerves because my lecturer, when I studied at Milan, she's also on this call, but I think she taught us very, very well. Um, yeah, so I've been in the skincare industry for the last um, 23, 24 years, and I really have an amazing, amazing passion um, for skincare, but also to use the correct skincare. And how do you choose at the end of the day? <clears throat> so I started with doTERRA a year ago, just over a year ago um, now. Um, and when I saw that I actually had a skincare range, for me, it was like, okay, because I am very stuck in my ways, um, but there's always chance for growth, obviously. But for me, it's very difficult to change, to really make a difference and to really change something in my life. So when I saw the skincare range, I was like, okay. And a lot of people started asking me about the skincare range because I know obviously I'm a somatologist. And I thought, okay, you know what? I can't, I can't lie about this. Obviously not. Um, so I need to start using it. Um, so today I really want to tell you and um, share my experience and also my knowledge with you about the skin and why it is very, very important to make sure that what you use on your skin will also have um, an impact on the whole entire body system. So I'm going to share my screen with you. <clears throat> okay, so let's go. Okay, now will be a good time. Okay. Oh, I had this problem as well last night. So I know it's going to give me troubles now again this morning, seriously. <gasps> Ooh, okay, wait. Let me just quickly stop sharing, yeah? Guys, I'm sorry. Please excuse this. Now, where's my whole thingy magic? Oh, my goodness gracious. Okay, let's try this again. It was just working now. Technology. Seriously. Okay. Girls, I'm really sorry about this. Okay, let's just go into this again. Okay, it's all thumbs. Okay, now it doesn't want to. Okay, can you girls see my screen? I'm really sorry about this, but I don't want to go into slide mode because I don't know what's going on. Okay, you can see it says the essential skincare one drop at a time. Can someone just say shop? Yes. Okay, thank you. Okay. So, yeah, as I say, for me, it's very, very important. Sorry about that, ladies. It's really important for me to make sure that whatever you use on the outside of your skin is going to have an impact on the full systems of our bodies. Okay. So when we go to the anatomy of our skins, it's very, very important to understand how the skin works and why can't I just use anything um, that I buy in clicks or anything that I buy in pick and pay or at the pharmacy. And what I always say is when you get to a stage or you go to a shop and you can actually take something from the shelf, pay for it and go home. You must understand that the quality the, and the purity of that product must by regulations must be so low that anyone can use anything from the shelf and it will not cause harm onto the skin or your body, et cetera, et cetera. So that goes for everything. All your vitamins, um, all your skincare, your essential oils, et cetera, et cetera. So I want you guys, when you walk, and you're going to remember this now, when you walk into, um, sorry, Clicks, I think Clicks hates me by now, but when you walk into Clicks or Pick and Pay or Desk and whatever, and you can physically just walk in there, take something from the shelf, which you're going to use internally or externally, pay for it. You must understand, and you're really going to start thinking about this every time. You must understand that you are honestly 
using stuff that is really just going to be excreted out of the body, okay, or it's not going to make a difference at all, or it's going to be more toxic inside your body than it's going to be good. So when we look at skincare, we classify it into much different categories. So cosmetics is something that you can literally just buy off a shelf. And you know what's really bad is the marketing of most of our biggest brands in the world is really because of marketing strategies, um, beautiful pictures they have in the magazines or um, on television or on Facebook or wherever. So you're always, always like, oh, I, always want, I also want skin like this. So the marketing strategies behind this is absolutely amazing. But unfortunately, as I said before, the ingredients can't be active if you can physically take it from a shelf and take it home and start using it. So when we go to the anatomy of our skin, it's very important to understand that this is a very healthy skin. So we have our epidermis, which is our first four layers of the skin, and then we have our dermis, which is the two biggest layers. Now, what cosmetics cause? It's because a cosmetic cannot penetrate into the deeper layers of your skin. Let's say your second, third, fourth layer. It is not going to have any effect on our dermis. And our dermis is where pigmentation starts. Our dermis is where our collagen and our elastin fibers grow and strengthen. And that's where collagen production also happens. So we want to make sure that we use something that can actually, not a lot of products can actually penetrate into the dermis, but we want to use something that's going to really have an effect on our, um, the, uh, our co collagen and our elastin fibers. So when we use a cosmetic, it might, might penetrate to our stratum lucidum or our second layer of our skin. It's going to go and sit on top of our first layer, but our stratum corneum is a dead skin cell layer but it's more there for protection to make sure that all the moisture and water inside our skin does not penetrate out of our skin. So it's a barrier. It really protects our skin. It protects the lower layers, um, but it also protects us in a little small way against the sun. But with today, with all the harshness of the sun, especially in South Africa, we need to make sure that we can protect our upper layer of our skin as well. If you have a very healthy skin, this layer will, will basically break up or it will shed within 30 days. Then your second layer is going to become your first layer. The third layer will become your second layer and so forth and so forth and so forth. So if we want a very, very healthy dermis and a very healthy skin, it might take our bodies up to seven or our skin up to seven months for us to really start seeing the difference. Because as I said before, a lot of our products cannot penetrate into our dermis. So it's very, very important, very important to make sure that what we eat and what is physically taken up into our bloodstream will have a positive effect on our skin as well. And that is what essential oils absolutely makes this amazing. Because we can use them topically and we can use them internally, and we can also use them by smelling. Okay, now you can say to me, okay, no, no, that's fine, it's on. I just went to this skin yesterday, and I bought myself some essential oils, nice eucalyptus, and needy crystal, and frankincense, et cetera, et cetera. But if these oils are not 100% pure, certified, therapeutic grade, it will not have a positive effect on your body. It can actually be very, very harmful to your body. Okay, and we'll get there now when we go to the how the olfactory system works. So for our anatomy in our skin, it's very important to protect the first layers of our skin, but it's also very important to use products that's really going to have an upbuilding and uplifting, rejuvenating effect on our dermis. So when our dermis is very healthy, it's going to look like this picture. So you'll have a thick dermis and you'll have a thin epidermis. But when you use the wrong products, your epidermis, because there's no growth in your, there is growth in your cells, but because there's no shedding of dead skin cells and your skin is not healthy, your epidermis actually becomes very, very thick and it starts pressing 
on top of your dermis. And that then causes that your collagen and your elastin fibers that keeps our skin healthy, plump, rejuvenated, um, that you don't have a lot of elasticity, that epidermis that becomes very thick goes and press on our dermis. And that then causes elasticity loss and collagen loss. When you are up to the age of about, I would say about 22, 24, you are not going to realize this at all. But once from 25, 30s, in our 30s, in our 40s, obviously you are going to see the rapid negative changes in our skin um, of aging. Suddenly you have wrinkles, suddenly pigmentation is starting, and then you don't understand what happened to my skin. Why is this suddenly happening to my skin? And it's all because what we did to our skins when we were, when we were, were little. Okay, so with our skin, how it happens, just a, court, a, short, a, court, a short summary again, is basically whatever we apply, it must be like a therapeutic grade, it must be a pharmaceutical product, stuff like that. Um, it will be penetrated, you'll, you'll apply it on top of your um, epidermis or your stratum corneum. And then the essential oils or the active ingredients will be carried into your blood vessels to give our bodies a systemic effect. Okay, so it's going to work on the systems of our bodies, even just by applying it. So the ways that we can introduce different types of essential oils into our body, and you guys are going to understand why I'm going into this, is we can use it in four different ways. So even, either we can use it in, as a suppository, either um, in our uh, anus or vagina, or we can use it as massage or topically. We can use it internally. And please, when I say this, you can only use the Terra Certified Pure Therapeutic Grade Essential Oil internally, okay? Or we can use it by in, inhalation. So when we use it as a suppository, it will go into the circulation much faster than, for example, uh, with topically inhalation or with internal use. But it is going to affect all our systems inside our body by just using these four effects. I, heard, I spoke to a mom yesterday that's really struggling with her little one with um, constipation. And she said that little suppository with one drop of Zengis works like instantaneously after that poor little child was like uh, very um, blocked up for almost two weeks. So this is, and especially if you have fever or really struggling big time, I will definitely use this. Okay. Um, so when we use our essential oils just by inhalation, it's going to trigger our limbic system. We're going to go into that now. So the limbic system is our, it's inside our brain, just behind. If you feel here where your bone is, your nose bone, just on top of that, just behind that is our olfactory um, nerve. So this is how it's going to happen. And I'm going to explain that to you now. So just by using essential oils in these four ways, you are going to target every single system inside your body. So when we go, when we think specifically of the skin, not just your face, but obviously on your entire body, your skin is your biggest, biggest organ. So if there's anything wrong on your skin, it's not just my skin, something that happens with, to my skin. There's a systemic problem inside the body, and that's why it is showing up on your skin. Um, maybe it's dehydration because you're not taking in enough fluid. Um, maybe you have eczema or psoriasis, which means that there's a lot of inflammation in your body. So there are different types, acne, breakouts, um, pigmentation. So all of those things lead to a problem inside our bodies, which we need to go and have a look on. And that's why I always say, you can't just use a skincare product and think that is going to change my whole skin. We need to go and have a look at why do you have pigmentation? Why do you have acne? And then if we can start working from the internal side as well as the external, you are definitely going to see a massive difference. When we use essential oils or when we use products topically for me it's very very important very important to always make sure that you use a type of carrier oil now that can be fractionated coconut oil which we use which is a beautiful beautiful blend uh, i'm not going to blend um, it is a fraction of oil 
but it is, you don't smell anything, it's very clear, and it's not oily. I know that's going to sound weird, but it's not oily. So it's going to penetrate into the skin very, very quickly. So I just quickly want to show you guys something quickly. Okay, I'm going to use my um, geranium. So if I use my geranium one drop on my skin like this, okay, and I'm going to like smear it all over, okay, it's only going to target this small little area. But when I use one drop, oops, that's a little bit more, one drop fractionated coconut oil with one drop of geranium, okay, it's going to cover a much bigger area than just by applying one drop. Okay, you're not going to dilute the potency and the quality of the essential oil. You can see, as you can see on the picture, if you use an essential oil just on the skin without diluting it with fractionated coconut oil, it's going to evaporate much quicker and it's not going to have such an amazing effect inside the body. But when we do use it with a carrier oil or in your skincare range, it's going to penetrate into the system or into your skin, into your epidermis and dermis much quicker and faster to have a better effect inside the skin and inside the body. Okay. So when we're talking about our sense of smell, remember that, that first picture that we had, this one that we had here. Okay. So we want to, if we can use essential oils or skincare range, that's going to have an effect all three ways that we can use it. How amazing is that? Okay. So how it works in all, our olfactory system, if you think about going to um, for an operation and you have to get laughing gas, okay, it's literally three seconds and then you're out. You are out, you don't know what's going on around you and they can physically operate on you. And essential oils work exactly, exactly the same. And this is why the purity and the quality and the sourcing of essential oils are so important. If we use a oil, essential oils, or we burn essential oils or incense or stuff like that, and it is not 100% pure, can you imagine what you are breathing in through your nose, into your factory system, into your brain? Okay. So it's very important to understand that to get a therapeutic effect from essential oils, they need to be the purest quality. Okay, so for instance, if we take frankincense, frankincense is the resin from trees. So if there's still a part of the tree, of the, of the wood in that frankincense, okay? Sorry, frankincense is the only oil that can penetrate the membrane of our brains from the, from the outside. So if you, for instance, there's a piece of wood in that essential oil, or it gets distilled with that piece of wood, you are going to get fractions of that wood into your brain. Do we want that? Freaking no, not a chance. So that is why it is so important that when we just, just by smelling our essential oils, it's literally going to have an effect inside your limbic system. From there, it will go into the, into the back of your brain, and it's going to have an effect all over the body. That is amazing. Okay. So um, where's my other little picture now? Okay. So what I wanted to show you guys. So when we have an effect all over the body, say for instance, this is our cell. Every little single cell inside your body. Okay. This is my cell. Our cells have as a membrane, which is fat. Okay. Water cannot penetrate our cells. So if we use antibiotics, in most 95% of times, antibiotics are a water-soluble medication. It can only go around the cell. So it will treat bacteria um, and any inflammation around the cells, but it will take us 10 to 12 days to finish a course of antibiotics. If we have a viral infection, the doctor will tell you, go home, sleep, drink enough water, your body is going to work on that virus by its own. But with essential oils, like specifically essential oils that we use, that is antiviral, antibacterial, antifungal, et cetera, that oil is an oil. An oil dissolves oil. An oil can penetrate oil. So your oil molecules will go into your bloodstream, either by the three ways or four ways that we spoke about how you can use it, and it's going to penetrate our oil 
going into the nucleus and start to fight the virus or the bacteria on the outside or on the inside of our cells. And that is why, again, it is so important to make sure that you use oils that can really have a massive difference on our systems inside our bodies. Okay, so let's go into our skin. Okay, this, I always, when I see this picture, I want to laugh because I know that there's a lot of people, I've got a little cream pee for this and I've got a cream pee for this and I've got one for this. And at the end of the day, they're all just standing there in the closet. Um, you're not use, really using them um, and you actually don't know how is the correct way of using them. So that's why it's very important for me in specific that if you use skincare ranges, that you make sure that they are in the same category. So you're not going to use a cosmetic with a pharmaceutical or a therapeutic grade um, skincare line. So please make sure that they're always on the same level, um, which is very, very important. So we need to sort out our cupboard and understand why we cannot use cosmetics. Cosmetics will block they will block any other ingredient that physically goes into your skin. So if we look at most of our common skin issues and we categorize them, the first thing that we notice a lot, especially now in winter times, is redness on our skin. So you'll get a lot of people with like, we call them telangiectasia, which is small little red vines, um, a lot of inflammation on the skin, people really struggling with, it's sensitive and it's very sore. So we can use, and that's the root of inflammation, it's mostly that, it, that causes that skin sensitivity on the skin. Um, and again, so it's very important not just to look at working from the outside, but also working from the inside of the body. So what is causing that inflammation in the skin? Is it all hormonal changes? Uh, changes. Is it people eating too much, very like spicy foods, um, a lot of alcohol, a lot of really bad stuff in their skins? Okay. So the recommend, recommended products that we will use extra that you can use in your skincare range is yarrow palm. We're going to go through that now. Our cedarwood, geranium we're also going to talk about, and our Roman chamomile. So those are essential oils that you can use extra. And you're physically just going to add one drop with your moisturizer um, or your serum, which I would rather um, say, um, and then you're going to apply it on top of the skin. Then we are going to into scars. So scars is most of the time it caused by acne or breakouts or like having scratches on your skin, hopefully not. But scars is very, if you really have them for a long time, you are going to struggle to get rid of these scars. But if they are still, I always say um, the same with stretch marks as well. Um, stretch marks, if they are still red, you will definitely make a huge difference on them. Red acne scars, um, but with our essential oils, you must remember that they are working from the inside of the body um, and they are starting to build up your collagen and elastin fibers and you are going to see a difference with these. So again, geranium, again, yarrow palm, frankincense, neroli, and immortal. Okay. Our second category is breakouts. Okay. Obviously, we see this a lot in teenagers, especially if they go through um, their hormonal stages, puberty. I have two going through this stage now, and it's not easy having two teenage boys in the home. <laughs> but yeah, they're all going through the hormonal phases. So you will get breakouts, then it becomes better, then it becomes worse again. So we really make, need to make sure that, especially in teenagers, that we really start educating them from a very small age um, how to take care of their skins. If you cannot control these breakouts and it's going to go into acne or very bad acne vulgaris, we call it, then you are going to start struggling with a lot of inflammation, a lot of tenderness, very sore, and then obviously after that, um, scar scarring. So we want to prevent that. And that's why I always say, moms, it's really for us, it's such a big, big, big task on our hands to make sure that we teach our children the correct skincare from a very, very small age. Okay, so that they know when they get bigger and they start seeing a little few breakouts or spots coming along, that they immediately know what to do to prevent their skins from going into a worse stage of acne, okay? 
So acne, obviously, also what we do get a lot is um, adult acne. So especially in women, and it does happen in men as well. Suddenly, they always have beautiful skin, always. And then suddenly, they're just starting having these vicious breakouts, which especially at the back of their necks or their arms or in the neck area, and they don't know what's going on. So again, we need to go back and see what causes that bacteria inside the body, what causes that inflammation, and then we take it from there. So essential oils that we will use um, for breakouts specifically, tea tree or malaleuca, same thing. Amazing oil, antibacterial, antifungal, antiviral, um, and it really is a, ma a massive, amazing oil for any skin problems, obviously with lavender. So these two you will always use together with any skin, any skin problem, okay? especially with breakouts and especially with acne. Um, then again, we have our Immortal, again, Geranium, and again, Frankincense. So I, see you, I think you guys can see where I am going. Okay, then brown spots, or as we call it, pigmentation. So we can get hyperpigmentation or hypopigmentation. Hyperpigmentation is one of our most common pigmentations that we get, especially in females um, due to aging or hormonal changes or sun exposure. So the pigmentation is very, very, very difficult to get rid of. I had very bad pigmentation after my pregnancies. Um, and I think finally now, after 10 years of my last pregnancy, I can really say that it is a little bit under control. Doesn't look like it, and I know, but my pigmentation was really, really bad. And very interesting, as soon as it, gets, as it starts summer, and when I used to live in the Kalahari, it was worse. When we go into summer, I can see my pigmentation starting getting, getting darker again. So getting rid of pigmentation is definitely one of the most and mo most difficult skincare concerns that we can get. Okay. But again, I'm going to say this again, we need to go and look where is the problem? What is causing the pigmentation? If it's hormonal, then we are definitely going to use essential oils that will make a difference in our hormonal balances. Um, sun exposure, obviously you will have to use SPF. Aging, okay, fine, let's fight aging. So the oils that we will use for pigmentation is frankincense, lavender, black spruce, which is also our product of the month, this month, sandalwood, and then also cedarwood again, okay. Then aging, okay, I think this is one of the most common concerns, especially in us ladies. Um, so this is our power packed ingredients and essential oils that we can use for aging, age prevention, but also treating aging. So there's evident um, um, test that was done in these four oils in the anti-aging process, but also slowing down the aging process when we start using them. So we want to, obviously we are all going to age, okay. And I think when you get over the age of 40, you start seeing it much quicker. So, but we all will age. But for me, it's very important to, gra to age gracefully. Okay, I don't want to be 80 and I still look like this because obviously you're just not going to be normal looking like that at the age of 80. But if we, if we can grace beautifully towards the age of 80, that is amazing. Okay. Then... Hopefully, this will be coming into South Africa um, in the second quarter, second half of the year, is our long life vitality. If you take this amazing, the, 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 the testimonies about people using this, okay, this is all your essential oils compact in these three um, jars, okay. This is going to be amazing, especially for the skin, people struggling with autoimmune diseases, um, like lupus, like MS, um, arthritis, rheumatism, people with loss of energy, depression, any emotional illnesses, etc. This is going to be an amazing range. So I'm not going to touch on this a lot, um, but we'll definitely go into that more when it finally arrives in South Africa. Okay. So what do we have in our skincare? I want to, oh, not what we have. What I want you to think about now is I'm going to play you a short video. But I want you to, while we are going, while we are listening to it, I want you guys to just think of what are some of the things that you love your skin about, 
and what are the things that you want to improve. Okay, now I really hope that this video is going to play and I'm actually too scared to freaking screen share. Okay, can you guys, can you guys see the YouTube um, page? Okay, just, just no, someone. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's quickly try this again. Okay, now? Yeah. Yes. Thank you. Okay. So you guys can sit back a little bit and relax and just listen to this. Okay, let me just open it. Okay. It's important for my product to be natural because we have so many toxins out there in the world. We're breathing, eating, drinking toxins every day. If we can eliminate that, we're just a little bit stronger. We're a little bit healthier. We feel a little bit better. To me, it's super important to have all natural, pure, no preservatives or natural preservatives products or ingredients on my face. So I have sensitive skin and I have dry skin. When I just moved to Hawaii, I'm always going back and taking climates. And after I got my facial, I touched my skin and it just felt completely hydrated. I've been an esthetician and massage therapist now for almost 20 years. And I was a little skeptical coming into this and I was blown away. I've spent years of working in the spa industry as a massage therapist and esthetician. And as I've gotten older and understanding my skin and wanting to move in the direction of natural skincare line, I can honestly say today, this is a product I can stand behind. Your skin can be your most beautiful asset, but only if you take proper care of it. Breakthroughs in technology and sourcing have, for the first time, made possible a skincare line that is both all natural and effective. Doterra is proud to introduce the Virage skincare system. Virage is a natural skincare solution made exclusively with the natural, helpful benefits of plant extracts, infused with the power of certified pure therapeutic grade essential oils. This amazing system is based on the best that nature has to offer your skin and consists of Virage Cleanser, Toner, Immortel Hydrating Serum, and Moisturizer. The Virage Cleanser is the best way to begin your daily skin routine. It naturally lifts away dirt, makeup, and impurities as it reaches deep into your pores to cleanse and purify. This cleansing effect is magnified by wild orange, melaleuca, and basil essential oil. The cleanser also hydrates as it reduces trans epidermal water loss while also providing nutrients and antioxidants to your skin. An important part of any skincare regimen is a good toner. With the inclusion of essential oils like cypress, coriander, and ylang ylang, the Virage toner tightens, tones, and smooths your skin as it reduces the appearance of pores. The refreshing mist delivery system makes it easy to use any time throughout the day. Immortel is one of the most popular doTERRA essential oil blends. By combining Immortel with the Breakthrough Complex L22, the Immortel Hydrating Serum becomes a truly remarkable product. L22 is a combination of jojoba, macadamia, and olive oil esters that mimics the skin surface lipids when after optimum health and appearance, which is typically around the age of 22. The fusion of Immortel and L22 promotes a youthful-looking, glowing complexion. The final component of the Virage skincare system is the Virage moisturizer. Using jasmine, geranium, and sandalwood essential oils, the moisturizer nourishes your skin, promoting an ideal moisture balance and helping to keep your skin hydrated throughout the day. When I use this product, it makes my skin just, it's hydrated, so then I feel good, I look good, and I'm at the top of my game. I feel good out there. And, you know, I don't need to look like some of these young girls around here. I'm the way I am. And you know what? It's great to enhance it. The cleansing part was kind of really a neat experience. It, was, it almost had this warming effect. And then the mist, I just love. I love that I don't have to, you know, take out a cotton ball and, and do that. It's simple, simple steps. The products feel clean. They feel pure, they feel beautiful, moisturizing, 
again, being in natural skin care line and using the essential oils, being at the integrity and the grade that we have, you can absolutely feel that just absorbing into your skin. And your skin is the largest organ of your body, so every single thing you're putting on it is very important. It's directly being delivered into your skin and into your system. I'm so excited about this new line. I love the aroma. It is beautiful, but what I love about it too is that it's really universal. And so I'm going to get my husband to start using this skincare line. I normally have the, um, the problem that I have to make skin them far, far greasy, some far, far dry. And with this thing, I feel like it's even, I cannot buy this that really in with another product. I love the toner because it felt so invigorating. I love experiencing the oils well and taking care of my face. Care for your skin just as nature would, with a blend of modern breakthroughs and natural remedies found only in the Barrage Skin Care System. Okay, I hope you enjoyed that. For me, that was really nice seeing that the first time. But again, I had to use it myself. So uh, I must tell you, I was so impressed by this range. Really, really, really impressed. Okay. So we are going to go into our Virage range. Okay, so we have, for me, what is really nice about this is obviously I thought because it has all these pure essential oils in it, um, which is not um, very cheap. I thought, oh my goodness, okay, there's a price coming on this range. But if you are a wellness advocate and it's very easy to become one, you basically just become a member of doTERRA. Um, if this whole range with all these amazing, amazing, powerful essential oils, if you get this whole range together, it's 1,600 rand, okay. The next big question I had was, okay, it's fine, let's try this, let's do this, but how long is it going to last me? Okay, so I use this range morning and night, okay? Cleanser I only used in the morning, only in the evenings, and I'm going to explain that to you guys now. And this range lasted me for four and a half months. Four and a half months, okay? Because it is so pure and so potent, um, and so strong, you only need a very, very small amount with your cleanser, with your toner, your serum, as well as your moisturizer. So if you take 1,600 Rand divided by four, it's almost 400 Rand a month for a pure therapeutic grade essential oil skincare range. Okay, so this whole range has been put together for optimal effect in every skincare um, category that we have. Obviously, you are going to use your, um, let's say for instance, you want to concentrate more on aging, you are going to, to, to add extra essential oils. If you want to concentrate on acne, you are going to bring in your tea tree and your lavender. Um, if you are want to concentrate on your breakout, on your, on your pigmentation, you are going to bring in your lavender and your black spruce and your cedarwood. So those are the oils that we will then add. But I always say, because this is so super potent, just start off slowly, okay? Just start with these four, and then you can gradually start adding um, things to our skin. Just remember, if your skin is not used to a range that is really working very deep into your skin, and you just suddenly to like burst your skin with all these different kinds of ingredients, and another essential oil, another essential oil, the chances of your skin having, a, we call it a healing crisis, is very, very big. So rather start little and then build up than having this huge collection and your skin doesn't have a clue what's going on. And yeah, as I said, you might go into a healing crisis and we don't want that. So we start small and then we start building up to at the end of the day where we can get optimal results with all the essential oils and the range that you're using. So our cleanser, I don't know if you guys can remember, but she actually used like two pumps, too much. Okay, I also started with ching, ching, and it was, no, 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 it's too much. One pump is 100% more than enough. And I use it to, I also use, um, uh, uh, what do you call it, a waterproof mascara. So it, it literally just cleans my, my um, lashes as well from the mascara. So you don't use, need to use an extra um, 
eye makeup remover. Very safe, very like, like calming on the skin as well. And your ingredients in your Virage is your wild orange. Okay, I was like, wild orange? Uh, okay, that's weird. I didn't know that wild orange actually has an effect on the skin. But it does. It really stimulates um, a, a dull skin. So it improves the, uh, the complexion of your skin. Um, and it really just smells amazing. I use my wild orange every morning with my um, yogurt. And it is beautiful. Okay, so the basil that we have is purifying. Tea tree we know. Um, then it also contains your amino acids and your lipids that is going to help to nourish and hydrate the skin. Then our coconut oil and our olive oil. So the olive oil is going to hydrate the skin so that it will, it will protect that first layer of our skin so that there's no transepidermal water loss. Okay, so that moisture doesn't just evaporate from our skin. So I only use that at night time. I do believe, and this is my, my personal opinion, um, that if you do cleanse your skin twice a day, that you are going to stimulate the skin, you are going to stimulate your sebaceous glands, and that might cause breakouts or it might cause um, more dehydration. So it can either overstimulate your sebaceous glands or it's going to, um, to stop producing sebum if you wash too much. So just once at, at night time, and, and then in the morning, you can literally just clean your skin. I'm going to show you guys now, um, how to do that now. Um, so that's enough. So that's why your cleanser really lasts a very long time because you only use it once a day. Is this range safe for children? Yes, it is. Uh, but we'll get to the do the serum now. But the cleanser is beautiful. So your teenagers can use this. Your husband can use this. Um, amazing, this cleanser for a shaving cream as well. So they can use that as well. Um, okay, then we have our toner. So what I do in the morning, as so I'm quickly going to show you what I do, is I always use these square cotton, oh, these square um, balls that you can buy them. You can buy them from Clicks. <laughs> these you can buy from Clicks or Deskim. So just these small little square gauze, and then I normally just wet it under my um, my tap just a little bit, take out most of the moisture, and then literally just one spritz of your toner, and then you're going to wipe all over your skin. What I love about the gauze is that it's not going to absorb the product like a cotton ball or co cotton round, um, cotton finger magic, okay? Because um, if you use cotton wool, it's really just going, to, just going to absorb the product and there's no product that's going to be on the skin. So it won't really have a good effect. So definitely with the gauze, it's also going to have an exfoliating effect, which is great. And then obviously you just toss it. So that's very easy. So one, one spritz of your toner, then I have my combination of my serum, my yarrow palm, and my grapefruit. Okay. I don't like mixing my oils beforehand, especially with my skin, because I do want to make sure that I do get the safest and the purest um, active, active and potency on my skin. Okay. So mine is almost finished. Okay. So my serum, then I'm going to use my yarrow palm. Okay. Don't know if you've guys seen this before. It's a blue, blue, blue. I call it my Smurfy oil. <laughs> okay. So I use two drops. I actually use a lot. Two drops um, in my hand, two drops underneath my tongue, um, and two drops in the evenings as well. Then with my Immortal, I only use that at this at night. I'm just going to apply a little bit to my hand. Oops, that was too much. Okay, and then my geranium. Or here you can you can use your tea tree, your lavender, doesn't really matter. Okay, so my geranium, just one drop. Okay, obviously I'm not going to apply it to my skin now, but when you apply it, you can apply it around the eye area as well, inside your neck area, um, and on top of the decollete as well. So that is going, are you going to apply this? Just love doing this anyway. Okay. So that is what I do. And then after my serum, don't know if you guys saw my Facebook live yesterday, um, is this little rose quartz roller that we have now, okay? I know Kanaya and Ermelin that also have the, um, ooh, what's that, what's that device name? Um, just put it in the chat for me quickly, please. Okay, that thing is amazing for cleansing in the shower. But what is nice about this, the roller quartz, of the quartz roller, is that you can put it in the fridge. 
So if you have a lot of fussiness on your skin, um, a lot of inflammation, it's really going to cool down the skin. And you're going to use it in upward movements to stimulate um, your skin and to get a re rejuvenating um, effect on the skin. But also, it's going to make a huge difference um, with, with stimulating your blood circulation inside the skin. So the absorption of your products will be much quicker and better. And then also going to stimulate your um, lymphatic system as well to drain all those specific impurities from our skin. Okay, so then after my serum or after my whole concoction that I've made here, you are going to apply your moisturizer. Okay, just topically, just again, just one, one um, this is more than enough. It's very watery, you guys can see that, okay? If you have very, very dry, dehydrated skin, this might not be enough for you, but that's why I would say definitely use your um, your yarrow palm and your immortal and your geranium. That's very important. Okay. And then, oh, I forgot to bring that now with. Um, then I do get a lot of questions from people about sunscreen. So I use Lamal Ye Lace. Um, it's an SPF 50. Um, I know that there are a lot of sunscreens out there, but please do not use something that you can buy and that's, that's go, go on saying from birth up to the age of 120. Do not use something that you can buy in clicks or pick and pay or disc Um Rather get something like um, your professional product. HelioCare is an amazing sunscreen. You get a range for little babies, um, toddlers, for adults. Um, you get a tinted one, but really use a sunscreen or a sun, sun block where you know that it's really going to make a difference. And if you're using an SPF of 50 and above, it's very important to understand that if you are in the sun constantly, and even with us being in front of the computers the whole day, it's also going to have a negative effect on your skin. So it's extremely, extremely important to know that you have to apply sunscreen every single day of your life. Okay. If you've been in the sun for more than four hours, you need to reapply that again. Okay, so that's our toner. Then we have our serum. Um, I will not use a serum um, at a very young age for people. It's very, 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 very active. Um, if they are struggling with breakouts, I will maybe just use it once or let's, let's say twice. I will start with once a week and then I will gradually go into, into um, twice a week. But I won't, won't use it more. And I will definitely make sure that I pump it into their hands because my boys will go like this. And they don't have a clue what they are applying and how freaking expensive it is, especially with the helichrysum and rose and um, frankincense. And um, so just one, one squirt is more than enough to give to them. Then the moisturizer, as I said, is very, very light, um, but it really makes a difference as well in dehydrated skins. Um, Great for inflammation, um, again, with your juniper berry, which is very um, um, detoxifying. It's really going to work great on puffiness, puff, puffed eyes, um, really going to reduce your fine lines and wrinkles as well. So that's your moisturizer. Yes, I will definitely use this in teenagers or from a younger age. So this whole range, except the serum, is really 100% safe for the whole family. Then we have our yarrow palm. Got, ladies, I really want you to go and research about yarrow palm. This oil is absolutely, absolutely amazing. If you are using a current skincare range now, do yourself a favor, get your yarrow palm and start using it with your skincare range. Okay, remember, you know what I'm talking about, a proper skincare range. Okay, yarrow palm is just absolutely, absolutely phenomenal. And what I love about this oil the most is the fact that it promotes your body's own collagen production. So you're not adding something into the body um, that is going to give collagen. It really helps the body to stimulate its own collagen um, production inside the skin in our dermis. Now, mine was finished. I think I finished it in February. I bought it last year, July. Okay, but I use almost six drops. So this is a 50 ml. Okay, there's 500 drops in here. So if you only use one a day, it's going to last you 500 days. Okay, that is like more than a year that is going to last you. Okay, 
I love my yarrow palm, so I use it um, in the morning and at night, and two drops under my tongue as well for the extra collagen from um, promoting my collagen production in my skin. But then it also, you must, I mean, just look at this difference. And this was after three days that this lady applied it to her hands. Obviously, very, very bad psoriasis um, and eczema there. So look at that amazing difference. Then it is also very good for reducing acne scars. Um, it's good for any soothing any scalp inflammation, um, liver inflammation. So again, it doesn't just work from on the outside of the body. It also works on the inside of the body. So your yarrow palm is a combination of yarrow and pomegranate from pomegranate, your essential oils. Um, so that's where it comes from. And then the yarrow gives it that, um, that blue, the blue color. When you apply it on top of the skin, let me just quickly show you, you're not definitely not going to look like a Smurfy when you're finished, okay? So it's really blue, 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 okay? And when you start applying it to the skin, it will become translucent. I don't think my hands are ever going to age <laughs> because I do this a lot, okay? So then it becomes completely translucent and within a minute, it's completely absorbed on top of your skin. Beautiful, beautiful oil. Okay, then we have our geranium, which is also 10% off this month. So you can really make it, do yourself a favor and get this oil um, as part of your skincare routine. It's strengthening, stabilizing, promotes clean, healthy skin, even helps with your PMS and hormone balancing. Remember, it's going to penetrate into the skin and going into our cells. Um, so it's going to work with our endocrine system. It's great for dry and oily hair. I also added four drops into my um, conditioner. So I want to see the difference that this makes. So awesome moisturizer, dermatitis, psoriasis, a cleanser, scarring, stretch marks, edema, vitiligo. Um, and then what is really nice for me is it has the same effect in effectiveness as amoxicillin, which is an antibacterial broad spectrum antibiotic. Okay, so this for me was really great. So just by drinking this, taking this internally, it's going to have um, an antibacterial effect around your cells. Then we have our Immortal, which is also our product of the month. Um, if you purchase over 200 PV, ladies, you need to get this oil. You need to get this oil. Um, and I'm not just saying it, but this blend is absolutely amazing. Um, the ingredients in here, um, and as you know, for example, rose, we cannot get in South Africa yet. Helichrysum is very expensive. Myrrh is very expensive. Frankincense is very expensive. And rose is almost, un, un, what do you call it, unbekostigbar. That's how expensive that is. So all of them come together in this anti-aging bomb. Not a blend, it's a bomb. Okay. Um, so it's not been diluted. So the whole oil, in all the oils combined together is 100% pure. There's no fractionated coconut in here. So you can dilute this, especially if you have very sensitive skin. I would really recommend it. It is a very, very, very strong and potent blend. So I would definitely um, dilute this. You can dilute it in another, uh, in another roller bottles. Physically, just throw in a quarter of a bottle and fill it up with fractionated coconut oil up until the end. So frankincense, inflammation, smooth wrinkles and fine lines, um, help soothing the skin and the nerves, sandalwood, uh, sandalwood for a healthy, smooth-looking skin, skin imperfections, lavender there for the healing, myrrh, amazing, youthful-looking complexion, helichrysum, um, and rose. I mean, this is just one of the most anti-aging most um, anti-aging oils we will ever find. What is also amazing about helichrysum is it is an immediate blood stopper. So if someone cuts them and you put helichrysum on there or you throw helichrysum directly onto the wound, it will stop the bleed immediately. Okay, and then I've just put this for you guys together. So to get your Immortal free, if you get your whole range and you get your yarrow palm and your geranium, then you will get the blend of your Immortal worth 1363 for free. Okay, then I just have a few befores and afters. This was only for, um, only using the Virage range. This was not using any of the other products. So you can see the inflammation 
You can see the difference in the um, complexion, especially in the pigmentation on her skin as well. Okay, you can see the difference there. This lady definitely had acne before. You can look at the acne scarring over there and see the difference in her skin. Beautiful. Even look at the moles there. Definitely became lighter. Okay, and ladies, that is me. So I really hope you enjoyed the class. I'm going to stop the screen sharing now. And then I'm going to open for questions. So who has any questions? Jy was te oulik. Is jy nodig vir questions? Ach, dankie, jy vrou. Jy vrou het my goed geleer, hoor. Okay. Um, so I am going to share this for you guys. I'm going to just upload it now onto, let me just stop the recording.